it must be an actor's dream to work on something like that. Jane? Absolutely. And it's a dream to work with Amy and with Kate, for real. Like, we all met in 2008. And uh, so it's very easy and uh, deep and fun. So, and Amy's a wonderful writer, you know. Well, that's what she's known as, you know, as a writer director, you know, first, and then, then a, a wonderful, wonderful actress. Does that help you in your performance, having a director who kind of knows about the, the acting thing? Yeah, she knows what we're up to. Kate, go ahead. I want to hear. No, no. Uh, yeah, it's, it's wonderful to be directed by such a talented actor um, because she really, she gives you space to do your own thing. She has a, a lot of faith in you. Um, and then just very simply and eloquently um, course corrects you if, if you're not quite where she needs you to be. We were yeah. talking earlier about how you also um, trust her because she wouldn't uh, put you in a position where you didn't feel good about your performance. Yeah, like when Kate and I first, you know, met at Amy's and we started shooting, we were both talking about how great it feels to know that we can do anything. Mm -hmm. Amy's going to use what is good. You know, yeah. that tape. Also, I have to give a shout out to Jay. You know, Amy's yeah. he is just insanely talented um i mean visually her movies are so beautiful and jay has you know everything to do with that and um uh i mean amy's films remind me of fassbender a little you know mm -hmm. so in the yeah. in the best way we when yeah. when i was talking with amy a moment ago we that's one of the things i commented about the film was you know it was shot beautifully i mean the, the the use of shadow the use of light the mundaneness of the of the furniture adds to the suspense and and uh, the the ongoings if you will of of, of the character right. yeah you would love jay jay is amazing just quietly how do, do you pronounce his last name kettle kate Kaitel, i believe Kaitel. yeah jay Kaitel is uh i mean what a He's probably one of my favorite DPs now. So you have been uh, a, around for a bit. You're a very busy actress. And in fact, I, uh, uh, Messiah was just an amazing series. I hope we get into another season of it. But uh, working, working on that set must have been uh, a, brilliant, a brilliant experience as well. It, yeah, it was. And it was a great treat to be able to go to Jordan. And uh, we, went, we were in Nashville. Um, but, you know and Washington DC where I was born. But to, to, I, I never thought I would see Petra, you know, so that was, it was a great, what a great experience that was. And everybody was. Now great. I could talk to Kate and say, uh, you're, you're a very busy young actress. Yes. Sometimes. Sure. <laughs> well, um, is, are, are, are you looking at maybe hopping behind the camera a little bit more? Um, potentially. I, I'm not really sure what the future holds for me. I'm sure a lot of people are in the same boat right now. But um, yeah, I, I love movies. I've always been interested in all aspects of them, all departments in front of the camera and behind. So, Although this experience with She Dies Tomorrow, your, your audition process was a little different. Are you both good at auditioning? I think I'm quite bad at auditioning. This was a, a very lucky experience where Amy and Jane and I have known one another for a long time. And she sort of wrote this with us in mind, which is uh, just a dream. But uh, no, I wouldn't say auditioning is my strong suit. Yeah, sorry. No, please. You know, obviously the surprise of, you know, having Josh Lucas on set and Michelle uh, uh, Rodriguez, that has to be, you know, like butter. It, it's like <laughs> jo they're both so great and josh is particularly like uh he he's such a good actor he's just such a good actor and michelle is too we just didn't have as much to do uh, mm -hmm. with each other and, and filming in, in in you know a single set like that too in a, in a house uh does that enhance your performance does it does it inform your performance more for me, um, yeah, I think so much of my portion of the film is about her relationship to this house, which she had recently purchased. Um, and the sort of absurdity of um, 
you know, quote unquote, owning something. Mm. Uh, and a leaf blower. And a leaf blower, <laughs> of course. Um, but yeah, it, it was great to come back to the same set over and over again. That is Amy's actual house. And so it's very, it's very steeped in the, in the entire story. Yeah. And, and your next projects, I'll start with Jane. What's your next project? So funny that you would ask that because you, you're a mind reader because I was just sitting here thinking like uh, after we are done with the interviews, I'm going to be trying to persuade Kate to come out with Amy because there's something I want to shoot up at the top of this canyon I found. It's a gorgeous location and I don't even, not even certain yet what I want them talking about, but I want to get them out there. <laughs> and, and, and Kate? That that <laughs> yeah, you're going over to Jane's house. <laughs> Sag after will be there. It's going to be a huge production on top of that canyon, probably. Oh, yeah. <laughs> for sure. Listen, thank you so much. I, I I'm telling everybody to, to you take a look at this film this weekend. Uh, it is absolutely it's creepy. It's wonderful. It's human. It's funny. And yet it's, it's got those elements that I think are very engaging in a film. And, and, and your, both your performances are just spot on. Oh, thank you so thank you much. much. What a nice thing. Have a wonderful day. Yeah, thank you, you too. Enjoy your day and enjoy your filming. I love your tie. Thank you. I, it matches my eyes. So there. <laughs> wonderful. We'll leave on a bad joke like that. <laughs> <laughs> no thank better way to leave. <laughs> Bye. Have a, have a wonderful day. You Thank too. you. This celebrity interview is sponsored by. I'm Annette Severella with Pia Anderson Moss Hoyt, Utah's leading entertainment law firm serving clients nationwide. We provide solid, attentive representation, focusing on minimizing risk, reducing cost, and protecting the reputation and privacy of our clients. Our goal is to provide you with the legal representation you need to make the right decisions and to protect you and your creative works. Call or email me for a free consultation.